As a hiring manager at one of the largest tech companies in the world, and having benefited greatly in my career from online education, I wanted to give my perspective on the real value of the Google Career Certificate. First of all, what are they and where can you find them? Can earning a certificate in any of the subjects that Google offers help land you a job and will they be well-paying jobs can this replace a degree or experience in this video i'll answer all those questions to help you better understand for yourself if these might be worth it for you so with that said let's get started google career certificates are certificates that you can earn by taking a series of online courses that pertain to whatever career track you're interested in that Google offers. These career tracks happen to be some of the most in demand in the job market, which is why Google created all these courses in the first place. They themselves need talent, but it's not just Google, it's many other companies, many tech companies especially. Now these certificate courses can be found on Coursera. This is one of the largest online learning platforms that has been around for quite a while at this point. It's something that I've used for many, many years. And Coursera is a platform I've talked about extensively on my channel so if you want to see more content on that make sure to subscribe down below and then of course check out some of the the videos on there and everything i'll talk about in this video you can find in the links down in the description below so make sure to check that out and when you go there you'll find that they offer a really good variety of different career tracks you've got cybersecurity, data analytics digital marketing and e-commerce it support project management and UX design, that's user experience design. Now I think this is a really solid list of career tracks, all with really good short-term or immediate-term potential as well as long-term career prospects. But let me know what you think down in the comments below if these are career tracks that you yourself would be interested in. Now most of these focus on foundational learning. So you can jump right into these as a complete beginner. You don't have to know anything at all about these topics. Now this is of course a really good thing because if you're looking to make a career switch, you really need to start with the basics. Now most of the tracks consist of five to seven courses. Again, this is all online and one of those courses is likely to be a capstone, which is really a project based course. And those projects essentially require you to put together everything that you learned in the previous courses all into one piece of work that really you can build a portfolio from. But once you complete it, you earn a certificate that you can share on LinkedIn or even on your resume. Now this is all fine and well that you get this cool fancy certificate, but the real question is, do employers really care that you got the certificate? And more important than that, can it help you land a job? Short answer is yes, these can help you land a job. The key word being help not guarantee. And I think it's very important to set your expectations on what this can really do for you. But there's more to that question, which is if it can help you land a job, how much can it help? Depends on a few factors. The kind of work experience you already have, what other education you might have in the form of some degree, and your ability to network. For example, if you want to get into data analytics and perhaps you have some background, some work experience in a business related role, then getting the data analytics certificate might be a really strong complement to what you already have in terms of formal work experience. And it might just be the advantage that you need. And again, presuming that you do a well enough job networking, interviewing, but to make that kind of move with the certificate, I think is not, wouldn't be terribly difficult. However, if your background is in say, fashion design, the certificate will be a step in the right direction. It's going to add a point of proof as to your knowledge in a specific subject. But you're gonna have to work much harder to prove to a prospective employer that you are truly qualified. And fortunately, the Google Data Analytics career track does allow you to do that. The capstone is a project, and so that's how you can get your start and start building that portfolio. But then you're gonna have to branch out, consult other resources, and start going on and sort of carving your own path and building out more and more proof points 
for those employers. And on top of building this portfolio, you're going to have to network like crazy. You're gonna have to work more diligently to establish the right connections with perhaps the companies that you are intending to go to or trying to get to. Anyway you look at it, it's very much possible to land a job with the help of these certificates. It's just that some people are going to start at different points. And for some, these certificates will be what gives them that slight advantage to land them a job. And for others, it's really just going to be a first step. Now, when you look at all these career tracks that Google offers, you might also be wondering, well, are these well-paying jobs? Now, if you look at any one of these certificates that Google offers, you'll find that the goal really is to set you up with an entry-level role. In terms of salary, this is often going to mean an average of between fifty-five dollars and $85,000 a year. But within a three to five year period, after being in that entry role, it really wouldn't be a stretch to expect a salary close to or at or above $100,000. Of course, that depends on the company you work for, the type of work that you're able to do, many other factors. So this is by no means a guarantee. But the bottom line is there is a lot of demand in the job market for these roles. And the pay is quite good because many companies want to attract strong talent. All that said, can these certificates replace a degree or experience? Unfortunately, this is not going to be a replacement for good relevant work experience. As I mentioned earlier, these certificates can be a good complement to work experience that is relevant already to what you want to go into. You'll still need to find a way to get that experience, which is why I recommend projects or say, internships or freelance work. There's a lot of ways to go about doing that. But if it can't replace work experience, can it replace a degree? I'd argue that it can. Again, the certificates are designed for entry level roles. And generally, if we're talking about a bachelor's degree, which is the degree that you would get coming out of high school if you decided to pursue higher education, that degree is going to include a lot of miscellaneous education that's not relevant to the degree itself. So it's a lot of time and money invested just to get you prepared for an entry level role anyway. But let's say you already have a bachelor's degree and you're now weighing your options between a master's degree and a certificate. Now, while master's degrees will still have a lot more weight to it, I would still consider certificates to be a viable solution, especially when it's a certificate with the Google brand behind it. But similar to someone with a complete lack of relevant work experience, you're going to have to work a lot harder to prove your value in this new field. And that means doing all the things that I've been recommending throughout this whole entire video. And if you put in the work and effort, you can certainly land a job with the help of these certificates. Now, these aren't the only options available. There are a lot of online courses and certificates out there. And one platform I'm a big fan of is Course Careers, where they offer various course tracks in IT, sales, marketing, and they have plans to expand that even more into the future. And if you wanna learn more about that, make sure to check out this next video right here. Folks, I hope this helps. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you around.